Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, and today I'm going to be playing some Magicite. So, if I name this guy Roglans, I get the first, like, good character. I want to circle through these a little bit first, see if I can get anything I want here. But the thing is, since last time I've had a uh, computer upgrade, so basically everything I unlocked has disappeared. Although I did go back through off camera to get the Berserker Scarf because I find it's quite a nice item. So I'm looking for attack and health here. That's quite nice. In fact that's really nice. I'm going to go with that. Plus two attack, minus one defense. Uh, twigs, don't use dexterity, don't use magic. Alright, let's go. Starting off quite strong with the items as well. I'm going to want to get some wood to make a pickaxe starting off. I guess I'm talking like this because I'm used to uh, doing my house play videos. Right, so now I have a pickaxe. And probably move these down. I can now actually start trying to find some deposits. I'm never going to be able to jump up there. I don't even think it's possible. Can go around this way though. I've got a few creatures down there that I'm probably not going to be able to deal with. I see 12 damage. Wow. Oh, I guess I'm starting off quite strong with 6 damage. Got 6 attack and now 7. Oh, 8 because of my buff. That's nice. And that, not so much. Taking four damage pretty early on is not... Well, five damage. <laughs> Come on then, slime. I don't want to get too close. I'm not dying to... Magic upgrade. It's pretty useless. Using those quite early on is also a bit... depressing. Alright, you go down there. I don't think I have to deal with you. I might as well. Get the XP and the webs. If I could find many more ore deposits, then I can start trying to build a wooden sword for the extra four damage. Uh, you just need one more. Ah, it's down here, so that should be quite simple. I think that's about it for the wood. And this is going to be a tough road if I have to go down below. Which I don't think I do, so I should be quite safe. I'm going to do this. There we go. And this guy could be a problem. I'll deal with this uh, flying guy first. Wasp. Does it have a buff? It has four. Oh, my attack's going to be quite high if I keep getting these attack buffs when I level up. I'm going to have to jump over there when it comes down. Wow, quite a trek to have to go through there. I do want to deal with some of these guys over here, though. Preferably this one first. That's nice, there we go. And that guy out of the way was quite nice, and then I've just got this boar. Should probably take two or three hits. If I jumped, that is. So, I'm gonna go with this. What does this give me? You and nearby allies deal bonus damage equal to your magic for 10 seconds. That's decent. Plus four damage. Equal to my magic. Not exactly buffing with magic. I don't really know why I picked the magic one, honestly. My attack is really high, so I probably should have gone with something like that. That was really stupid of me just to walk into that swamp thing then. I have a free health potion. It's not really free, but 
is decent enough. So what do I have over here? Nothing too threatening. Probably want to go over the top just to be safe. Probably all the way until the end and then I can deal with this ball. Do I have... I need two more stone, which I can pretty much get here, I'd say. No, oh, this, this guy's going to be a pain to deal with because of these... Nope, can't quite get him there. I'm not going to be able to get him there either, am I? There we go. Got the one more so I can actually make a pick out of this. As soon as I make the blade. Can get rid of that one. Plus one dexterity. Yes, that's nice. Sort of try and dodge these things. Deal with this guy. And try not to die. It's quite a pain there. Swamps aren't easy to avoid. The herbs are nice, and especially that HP buff as well. Could do with trying to get some more, though. Nothing too dangerous over here, is there? That doesn't seem... I don't think those things are actually dangerous at all. I'm going to get 2 XP from these. 2 XP at best, it looks like. Oh, I would usually take this on when I want the XP, but... Right now, I'm at diddling low. And even lower. Well, you know you can die to a slime, it's not looking good. Ah, I probably should have eaten, just to be safe. This guy shouldn't be a problem, it's the nest I'm worried about. Eh. That's decent. This guy won't jump off, will he? Oh, there we go. There's quite a lot of deposits here, so it's quite a lot of iron, and that's good news. This guy only deals one damage, but I do need to be careful. Two herbs. It's basically healing me for two. That's why they're always nice to pick up. Or at least it's nice to just go try and go kill the slimes. Come on, then. Oh, two health potions. Nice. Back up in tip-top shape. And the slime could be an issue. Not anymore. There's no thingy up there, is that No. I think I'm going to go the safe route. Especially with how close I just came. See if there's anything here I can have. I don't think so. Wow. That's expensive for what it is. I do love this music. Four. Four iron. I would like to make armor, but I think it's best to make blades and then make weapons, presumably. I don't want to uh, make too many of those. Wow, oh, what am I doing? don't want that. Probably go with the stone pick. Sounds nice. Why did I make two sword hilts? Oh, no. That seems nice. Right. I don't think I'm going to need a axe for a while. On turn. I don't know how iron is compared to bone. 
Oh, this isn't the cell guy, is it? Over here. Sell me your treasures. Is it just two for, like, everything? I think it is, isn't it? Right. I think that's decent. Let us move on. Actually killing this guy. Getting a bit of coins. Oh, there we go. Right, that's at the end of its life. I don't think I need to do another one, but I didn't sell that. Mistake. Could go with the uh, attack buff. I keep forgetting to use this. Probably safe not to use it on a slime. You're gonna get double everything. Oh well, at least double most things. I have uh, the more iron I can use. That's nice. I can actually take out this nest now as well. Four hits. That was unexpected. And away is nice, easy XP. Now down here seems pretty safe actually. Like really, really safe. Apart from this boar, who's probably just gonna kill me after saying that. And I stick by my word, landing on boars and them um, taking damage from them is still really stupid. Although, I should probably not be stupid by landing on them. Right. That spider's just gonna fall down there. I saw that being a problem incoming. Almost at 20 damage, that's nice. Probably kill this guy with a pick. Yes, I can. Okay, just a few uh, pigs up here. It's always nice for XP, gold, and then you have the food you get out of it on top. Don't worry me, just fertilizing the lawn. I always find that a very strange feature. It seems like a Binding of Isaac thing. It just doesn't seem to fit the game. I mean, I get it's supposed to be humorous, but this game doesn't feel like the humorous kind to me. What does this do? This just always give you a random thing. Perform an extra jump while summoning a better sword based on attack. Well, that's going to be quite high. Forty damage. If I ever get to that damage, I will be unstoppable. Well, I guess until something starts throwing projectiles at me. Or balls that I end up landing on. I'm going to stick with the easy route just for now, build myself up a little bit. 400 for a club. Seems a bit pricey. I don't really see what the use is for it. Sell this because I didn't mean to make it. Sell this. That is a lot of herbs looking at it now. And that is a lot of money as well. 
I actually have a lot of items. I have a lot of everything. Refined bones. A lot more potions. So I can make bone armor. That sounds really cool. Make some more uh, ionite. And I'm going to make a bone shield because, well, let's face it, that sounds cool. Plus one HP. That is not a lot. How much do you get from something made out of iron? Plus two HP and plus four attack. That is a lot better. I, I'll stick with the bones just for now, just in case I need them for replacements. Yeah, I guess looking at this, it is quite a low price, so I guess bones are easier to come by as well. Yeah, Monster Hides just sold it all. It's starting to look like a bit of a ninja now. Nah, it's kind of pointless to go down there. Let's open up this chest. What do we get? A fire starter. Still don't know what this does, apart from, well, the obvious. Should have uh, smothered that as well. I got a few items, that's always nice. Oh, right, okay. Ah. Cook all the meat. That's a really nice feature. I guess I can't see you doing much more than that, though, apart from damage, possibly. So I presume if I come across a boss, I just press Z and then the boss is pretty much GG. Wow, these potions. This is a boss, isn't it? Fifty-four damage, well. Wow. And he does four damage. Now that is uncalled for. Come on then, Mr. Boss Man. Or whatever you are. How much health does this guy have? Well, wow, like, really? Okay, well, I'm dead to whatever that is. Pretty powerful at that rate as well. Alright, well, I guess that's that run. Come to a closed end by some strange creature. I guess I'll give it one more try. So, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. I am probably going to do another one in two days, see if I can try and get further. But then next week is Fallout 4, so you probably won't be seeing any more Magisai for a while. So, thanks for watching, and I'll speak to you all next time.